Hi everyone, what's up? Thank you so much for being here. If you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Jessie. In today's video, we are going to play with the Profusion Day Face Palette. So if you guys want to know my thoughts about this product, then please keep on watching. So this is $6.99 and the packaging is made out of metal. And if you guys do not know what Profusion is, if you shop all the time at Ross, Burlington, TJ Maxx, from time to time Walmart, from time to time Rite Aid, so it's that brand it's like a very affordable brand and now they are actually in target which i am very proud of this brand because it's one of those brands that i really love but not a lot of people know about it so in this palette you have four eyeshadows and two shadows for your brows and then you have your highlight and contour and you have two brushes now this brush you can use it for a blush for contour and this brush of course for the eyeshadow now let me give you some swatches they are a little powdery but i really love it because you can see the color and it's really creamy oh my goodness look at that and these are your brow colors you can also mix them together and this is your highlight and this is your contour. They are all really nice and creamy. So I'm gonna start with my brows. I'm just going to mix them together eventually. And then I must say that they really improved the formula. So I'm gonna grab this shade right over here. It is matte and it's perfect because you can use this as transition and you can use it all over your entire eye area as a wash color. Even though the eyeshadow here is only four colors, this is, I must say that this is like an everyday basic palette that I see myself grabbing if I'm traveling. I wish that there's a blush here. I feel like if there's a blush here, it would complete my life instead of the brushes. Do you know what I mean? So what I'm doing right now is I'm actually putting the bronzer on my crease and after that I will intensify it with the darkest eyeshadow in this palette and apply that on my outer V as well. So far so good, I love how it applies very nicely. It blends very effortlessly. Don't get me wrong, I'm not paid to do this. It's just that you just have to really try different brands to see and feel the difference. And then after that, I am going to get this shade and apply that on my lid. There you go. Usually I would just do matte here, but uh, I'm trying to use all of the eyeshadows here, so yeah. So after doing that, I will be using the crease brush again on my outer V just to blend the harsh line. And then could you believe that I am trying a different brand for eyelashes right now? And I just find them pretty, so I just want to try them out. So this is from Kiss, and this is the Blowout Lash in this style shag. So for four pairs, you will be paying $11, I believe. The whole reason why I picked them up is because of the style of the lashes. So they have five different styles just correct me if i'm wrong but that's everything that i have seen in the store and i picked this one and the other one i will be showing you guys later on on my future videos so i'm just putting a little bit of color on my waterline and then i will be putting the kind shade on the inner corner of my eyes just to brighten everything up now i'm gonna contour my face using the bronzer shade of course and this is my favorite part of makeup because it gives you the illusion of me not eating rice for a week. So basically, I have used everything and then I just realized when I was on my way to work, I just realized that, oh my goodness, I forgot to use the highlighter. So as soon as I got home, what I did is that I actually already removed my lashes. What I did is that I sat down, turn on the lights and then apply the highlighter so basically i'm just doing this so you guys could see what the highlighter looks like on my skin tone that's what it looks like as you can see my face is incredibly oily but my eyeshadow my brows is still there and that's what the highlighter looks like you know, sometimes when you overthink in life you tend to forget things by the way please pray for princess so she is crazy sick we just found out that she has kidney failure and i'm losing my mind i really am losing my mind girl so she's in the vet right now she has to stay there for a while hoping i'm really hoping for the best so please keep her in her in your prayers for my lips i will be using the nyx soft matte lip cream in stockholm and the lip liner suede in stockholm as well 
Now I'm going to be flat ironing my hair using my Irresistible Me Diamond Flat Iron. And then, I don't know why, but I'm addicted to <laughs> this flat iron right now. I can curl my hair, I can straighten it out. I just really love this stuff. And it doesn't make my hair feel crunchy. Mind you that my hair is actually bleach. So at first I was scared, but you know what? It didn't do anything on my hair. But don't get me wrong, I only do this once or twice a week. So this is the final makeup look for today, guys. To tell you guys honestly, there is absolutely nothing to complain about the palette. The brushes are just okay. I'm gonna tell you right now, it is, I feel like the brushes are not the best, but I love the brushes that they have in the vault. For this one, it's just okay. Seriously, Profusion is gonna go a long way. I'm telling you guys right now, if you do not believe me, try one of their products and you'll see what I'm talking about. It is amazing. That is pretty much it for today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. And if you are still not part of the Sassy family, go ahead and subscribe. I upload almost every day. Just turn your post notifications on. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.